Hi, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2, episode 25. Okay, so what happened last time was we helped Captain Monroe get some vaccines that the government was withholding. Then we also went and helped Eagle Flies and his friends, but um, one of his friends ended up going missing, and so he went to go look for them. The army showed up, and then Dutch decided to ditch him. And um, Dutch, of course, was like, that's perfect for our plan because it's a big distraction and da 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 So what we're going to do today is we have either a Trelawney or a Sadie mission that we're going to do. Then we're also going to go see Hamish. And then I'm going to do one of the quests that I've been avoiding, which is either Marco Dragic, Arthur Mason, or um, Albert Mason, sorry, or um, Flacco Hernandez. So we'll we have see. a lot to do. Yes, we do. And I'm sorry, but I need to take a moment of silence to show you guys this shirt I found. And I thought it was just hilarious. So, um, ciao. Anyways. Doki Arthur. Okay, so this time it really is up to you. Okay? Okay. Do you want to go talk to Trelawney? Or do you want to go talk to Sadie? They're on opposite sides of camp. Sadie. Okay. Sadie needs to speak with you. Uh oh, Montreal. Good job, Arthur. I was worried he was gonna fall. I know, me too. Hey, Sadie. This is that Adler. was quick. Uh huh. You okay? Peach. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people bickering. Fighting and lying. It makes me real sad. Hmm. I know. I need someone to ride with me. To do what? Finish off them O'Driscolls. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw Colm swing. I, I just don't care. I know, seriously. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me and to my husband? You're the only one of these fools that I trust. Oh, I've got to do this. No doubt. Help her or don't help her? Help her. Okay. Definitely. I'll tell you what. I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail. Jack. John. Make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But... When the time comes... Mm, how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean it. Help them escape when I... You know, you and me... We're more ghosts than people. But them... They... They could... I know. Of course I will. Mm, Thank nice. you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now, or... Meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can. Ride with her now or stay behind? Ride with her. Thanks, Arthur. Okay. Come on. Let's go, girl. I do feel for her. But I mean, yeah, I like Colm hung, so it's like, you know. Yeah. But I get it, she wants to kill all of them, so. I don't blame her. Yeah. Okay. There's that deer that you think deserves to be shot. No, not now. I know, look at him, look at his little tail. I know, I just saw that. So, so big. Oh, what's <clears throat> happening? <clears throat> we had a nice little camping trip, huh? I guess. I'm mourning for a killing. Hey. You seen anything down there? Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them down there. I'm mostly drunk. For one of them, it's a fat fella with a beard. Him? He's mine. Hmm. No, no. Okay. It's a big ranch. Okay, okay, I don't even have any good guns. Can I get my gun? Down. Lots of folk there. Sorry, give me but a second, Sadie. Pretty thin. I'll set it off and then we'll we'll take it from there. Take it from there. Okay. So no real plan then. <laughs> Just like oh, that. Yep. Now come on. Ooh. Is that a woman? 
Jesus! Who the hell is that lady? Hey! That's the lady from the hanging! He's squatting and then not squatting yes. over and over. I like your sword just watching him. Mm-hmm. There's a shot shooter in the hangar. Oh, is it? Damn, right in the head. Oh, okay, he's dead. Hey. Yeah, well, I got a quarrel with you, bitch. I'm gonna say you got the guy with the beard. Oh yeah, you're right. I need to be careful not to kill him. Wherever he is, I haven't seen him yet. Just shoot her. I don't care what she is. Okay. You take the barn. I'll take the farmhouse. Let's go. If he's fat and he's got a beard, he's mine. Yes, ma'am. I'll try. There's guns all over this barn. Look at it. Come on. The lady outside don't want none of you coming out. Let me get this guy. You come back here, you little son of a gun. Oh, I don't think the guy from Ash vs. Evil Dead. Ash. Oh, really? Yes, I did. I don't know who that is. Uh, we saw him in a movie. He's the guy, um, I don't know. We saw him in a movie. No, we did. Sorry, that was unhelpful. <gasps> no, I'm about to die. Anything in here? And I'm drunk. Arthur's always drunk. Mm-hmm. Going into the farm air! Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. Let me go. Let me get my hat. I can't get it. And I don't want to leave her alone for too long. No. Oh, I thought there was an entrance back here. There's no I did too. Wow. Can't get in this house. One entrance and that's it. Jeez, I feel like I've ran around the entire house. Yeah, you have. Oh, there's Sorry. Joe now. Oh, she upstairs. Uh oh, there's a struggle. I hear a struggle. Arthur. Arthur, fucking walk Take a little faster. What are you doing? Oh, Arthur, please. Yeah, she wanted that thing. Yeah. You okay? Yeah. He was a good man, my Jakey. Sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, mm. every moment. Oh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. Mm. I ain't even got that. <laughs> Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. Uh-oh. I know the company you keep. The now competition ain't connection. too fierce. What'd you say? Now you want a love connection. No, yeah. not between these two. We should get away from her. I always thought there would be a love connection between them. Yeah. Did you? I did, yeah. Well, it'd be perfect because she's on the run all the time anyway. Mm -hmm. Just like he yeah, is. she's in the gang. Yeah, literally. I think I need to be alone for a bit. Okay. I understand. You uh, might want to get yourself cleaned up. 
<laughs> Thank you, Arthur. You're Where welcome. Are you gonna do that? Yeah, literally go to a pond or something. Okay. Are you gonna loot? No, honestly, I'm not. Just because there's like, where's my horse? Oh, she's over there. Just because there's, I have so much money. I don't really think there's a point, you know? Yeah, you've gotten too good for looting. Exactly, honey. I'm right here. There you are. Hi, girl. I need to eat something. Let's see. Oh, actually, that's pretty good. Right? Yeah, that's Would good. you eat? Some beans or something like that? I honestly didn't. Oh, baked beans, yeah. Nice. You have discovered a gang hideout. Really? I have? <gasps> Look, we're right next to Albert Mason. How perfect is that? That is nice. That is nice. Okie dokie, let's go see this man. See what the hell he yep. wants. Oh, let me. What you holding your horsies for? Putting my hat on before I upset anybody. Oh, I thought you didn't get it. Oh, but you always can put your hat on in your like on yeah. your horse. Okay. Yeah, she holds all your outfits. She's like the um, wardrobe from. Yeah, I thought what you was lost that? in that barn. Yeah, but you can always like you can access all of your outfits. Okay, mm -hmm. you get it back. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Mason. Mr. Mason, where are you? Yeah, I'm gonna hit you with a horse. Just jokes, I wouldn't do that. Of course you wouldn't. Hello. Hmm. Pick and examine plant. Nice. Getting some yummy little carrots. Mmm, for a stew. It's funny, it's a white stem. Yeah, it is. No white flowers on the stem. Well, it's wild, you know, so. Oh, there he is. I didn't even see him. Well, hello. Hello again. Hello. Oh, hello. How are you, sir? Uh, Morgan. Mr. Morgan. I'm sorry, my... My nerves. God, you're out of breath. What's going on right now? Outdoor adventurer, I thought. This is God's own country, and I feel I'm in purgatory. <laughs> I know the feeling. No, oh, I hope not. What you trying to take some pictures of, huh? Some more greedy coyotes? No. Wolves. Whoa. Mm -hmm. well, you really are trying to get yourself eaten. No, oh, I yeah. hope not. I left the meat over there. I thought I'd be safe. Given the wind. Yeah, sure. You managed to attract the world's least intelligent wolf. Well, I, I... I'll stay with you a while. If anything comes, I'll protect you as needed. <laughs> nice. You are a gentleman. Now, you don't know me very well. He to always me, says that. You're a gentleman. Yeah, something to mean to yourself, Arthur. I'm worse than the wolves. You had many dealings with wolves, Mr. Morgan? Sure. But you've never been eaten. Not through lack of trying on their part. <laughs> A while back, I helped a friend from getting devoured. Usually, they are not great fans of man. Don't blame them. Me neither. Hey, shh. Here's one. Looks like we got company. Yes, yes, there they are. In the trees. Now, don't do anything. I'm going to take a few of Okay. Photographs. Come on. Come on. Oh god. They're so cute. They are cute. Good boys. Hungry boys. Come on. He's like, hey. Stay That's his living meat over Can't have a man in the frame. They think it's staged. Yeah, sort of is. Look at them. Magnificent creatures. Uh -oh. Especially when clawing at your eyeballs. Oh fuck. Oh, fuck. Stay still, my beauties. Okay, um. Oh, I don't know what to do! Oh. oh my, they don't seem to be fans of modern technology. 
technology. On the other hand, look at I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god, oh my god, holy freaking crap. Please don't kill me in the heart. I'm sorry. Rest in peace. <laughs> nice. Please don't. Don't hurt me. Don't leave me. You're okay. Hey, is that all of them? We might have kept the wolves from the door. No, no, no. You're okay. I hope you guys pictures. Oh, futile existence so. flashed <laughs> before my eyes. Yeah, Maybe they yeah. can be pretty aggressive. What a way to literally a dog's dinner. Still worse things happen at sea. Do they? Well, I imagine. Perhaps wolves do better at sea. Are they good swimmers? Well, who knows? You have saved my poor foolish skin once again. Yes. Don't mention it. Well, I can't begin to repay my debt of gratitude. But no, I am eternally in your debt. I do, Mr. Mason, I do. You take um, care Arthur, now. turn around. I want, those you do, wolf, I want that wolf meat, so turn your little ass around. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that went perfectly, I think. I think so. They got awful close, didn't they? They did. They got a little close for comfort. Oh, yes. Arthur, freaking pick that shit up. You're pissing me off. Thank you. Stone. Okay. Now, let's see. Oh, what's this? This must be where the legendary wolves are, huh? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if that's true. I think that's actually not true, so Maybe. I'm sorry. Yes, I wish I had something cold to wear to go see Flaco Hernandez. You mean see. something warm? Sorry, yes. Thank you it's very much. It's cold where he's at? Yes. So what do you want to do? You want to go see Hamish? I mean, we could go try to get a jacket and then go see Flaco. What do you want to do? Let's go get a jacket. Yeah? A little bit of fashion. A little something, something. Okay. Let's go. Come on, honey. Come on, honey. Yeah. And if we see any bridges, let's let's one second. I wanna I wanna look at something really quick, okay? Alright. Oh, wrong one. Sorry. Every time. What are you talking about, Arthur? <laughs> Every That's time. You. I know he's so dramatic. Piece together map, yes. Okay. Let's see, because someone was like, you didn't recognize that? Hmm. No. So Wait, we're do looking... they recognize that or that? I, I just think they, they mean like this area. So I guess we'll keep an eye out for a bridge. A bridge. Maybe yeah, a broken down house. or something. Yeah. Okay. A broken down cabin. Yeah. So if we pass any bridges, you know, we'll just keep our eyes peeled. Yeah. That's where the body's gonna be? Uh-huh, apparently. Or the serial killer. Which one? Serial killer. Yeah, huh. Shit! What's up? Hey, this here's a private financial matter, so why don't you keep right along? Not looking to interfere with any sensitive financial matters, I'll leave you to it. Hey! See, I was leaving until they said that. I just can't let that slide. No. Unfortunately. You can't do that. You use that damn thing? I had a real pressure you just being an idiot. I don't know. This ain't a mine we're in. But the principle's the same, ain't it? Should I leave him alone? You speak. No, get him. Well, you're taking too long. <gasps> I'm always shooting off his damn hat. Oh, Arthur, you're embarrassing me. I don't even think I have any dynamite. I think I just killed these people for no reason, I think. Oh, I do have some dynamite, good. Okay, so let us. <gasps> no way, I, no fucking way I killed him. I was gonna say, he's fine. He's fine. Oh my god. A little dramatic, though. Yes, it was. 
Oh wait, no. How do I? I thought I could go into first person. I'm not really sure how to do that. Uh, no. Oh, there we go. Okay. dollars Now look at that. Look how easy that was, huh? Forty dollars. That's like a midnight in first person. Yeah. Hi. Look how pretty she is. She is beautiful. Wow. You look gorgeous. Oh, what is that? You have a scar. What? Oh, that's just her muscles. She's just a muscly girl. Yeah, I thought she, she had a is. scar. Okay, now we're leaving, honey. You no don't feed her that enough. often. That's why she's muscly. Yep. See, she good. Has no body fat. So she's. You think she wants to be fat? No, I said she has no body fat. Oh. I think she loves the way she is. I think she's perfect. She's like, I wouldn't mind a little extra food. <laughs> oh, wait, this is a bridge. This is a bridge. Oh, no, this isn't. This is some tracks. Close enough. Incorrect. I'm just like looking for things and stuff. Yep. All right, let's go. We're about to take them trees out. Ooh, there's an uh, enemy back there. I'm always taking trees out. Yeah, you are. Yeah, I am. Beautiful area. I feel like this is where we were in the first video whenever Arthur... Um, whenever yeah, Arthur, yeah. like, broke the cabin on accident. I don't remember that. Oh, yeah. I want to look at it. One second. Let me see if I can find my rifle. I just want to zoom in and look at what's going on over here. Oh, just some people camping. Ain't none of my business. You gonna take them out too? No, says the woman who asked me to kill that innocent oh, man. Oh, really? Kind of innocent people. That was terrible of me. It was, yeah. I agree. And yet you did it. I had to. You're right about that. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, moi, si vous plaît. Get lost! What are you talking about? Shit. You there. hold up a second. You're lost. Oh, there's four oh, of they... them. Forget about it. Oh. I'm just fine alone. I'm just fine alone. Well, you're yeah. with three other people, so. Yeah, really. Okay, here's a bridge. But the bridge in our map didn't have a thing over it. No, it didn't. So I'm leaving. Yeah. What did you say? I did nothing. What are you talking about? I thought you were going to say something. Oh, why? Because you moved. Oh, I'm not allowed to move anymore, no, guys. No, you're not. We heard it here first. Yep. Highly offensive. Mm -hmm. You got a secret little door anywhere? Kick dirt, you hear me? What the hell? Excuse me? Oh, oh, That's this right. is the this down one. I tell it on out here. Good, good. Keep Where do going. you think I'm going? What do you think? Bitch. Nice. I gotta go. Took him right out. I can't. I'm sorry. I can't kill you. I apologize. Apologize for what? To the dog. Oh my god, the dog's chasing me. Oh shit. Dog, leave me alone! No worries. The dog can't catch me. Okay, good. He was scared. Oh my god. He's like really coming after me though. I see that. He's still running. Damn, he's fast. How is a dog this fast? There's a bridge. Uh, yes, it is. And the dog's gone, so you can look around. Good. And there's a question mark. Not seeing a ha- Oh, oh. <gasps> oh! OMG, I think this is it. I do too. That was a broken um, cabin. <gasps> Let me get on my map. Oh my god. Let me get a shotgun or something out. Oh, I can't. We'll just stick with our normal guns. <gasps> okay, let's open up our map. Oh my god, how crazy is this? What are the freaking odds? Nice. Uh, no, what am I doing? Put your journal away, Arthur. Now's not the time for that. Ugh. Okay. 
Got to see what the code is. Okay. 63432. Oh. Nice. He remembered it for yeah, me. Yeah, you don't have to worry about it. Very nice. Guys! What the holy hell? Oh. You better walk down with your gun. Arthur, put your bandana on, and then also we'll get out our gun. Oh, it's so dark. It is. Where's my lantern? I don't know my lantern. What? What? No, it's too hard to see stuff in first person, so. Oh. Gross. Jesus Christ. Well, somebody's been here soon, isn't oh, it? Recently. Oh, yeah. Missing girl. Oh my god! Oh, wow. There's a torso over there. There's a body. OMG. This is crazy. <gasps> oh what is God. that? That looks like an orc head or something. That doesn't even look like a human. Oh, really? Right, don't you think? Yeah, definitely. Look at those teeth. That's so weird. Oh, no. <gasps> His mouth is stitched closed. Oh. Inspect knife. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> for me or was this all nasty surprise wow or maybe it's both maybe it is a nasty surprise even though you knew i was going to be here which is it you should think about that save yourself Thinking about what's about to happen now. I'm not going to lie. It's not going to be nice and fun. I mean, it'll be fun for me, but it won't be nice for you. <laughs> nice. Stupid son of a fucking bitch. Oh no, I'm in first person. I hate this. I hate this. Uh, uh. Oh wow, really? You went out with one? <laughs> okay, guy. Arthur, come on. Now's not the time to get nervous. Okay. Oh, okay, we're turning them in. But I wanna I wanna look up wait, I wanna look at I wanna look at this area really quick, okay guys? I'm sorry. It has to happen. Yeah, I want to look at, see what's going on in here. Oh, premium Siggies! Oh, Siggies now? I always call them Siggies. Oh, I didn't know. Sorry, I think that's funny. Famous gunslinger, let's see. Come on, let me see who it is. Oh, can't see shit. Oh! I'm going to see him. Oh, are you? Yes! That's freaking crazy. Let's see what our man looks like. I can't see anything because it's so dark. Nice. What's his name? Flaco Hernandez. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, to the editor. Dear Mr. Editor, I must say I'm alarmed about the paucity of coverage your August journal has dedicated to the recent killings in the region. The perpetrator of these crimes is clearly a man of great intelligence, power, and no small amount of cunning. He presents a clear and present danger to all readers of your publication and most probably to the writers of it as well. I would suggest you begin to treat him and his creations with the reverence that they deserve. God help us all. Yours, a concerned citizen. Okay. Thank you very much. You got another letter to inspect? Um, read. Fa letter to Edmund from Mother. 
My dear Edmund, what has gotten into you of late? Our dinners together, which were once a pleasure to me, have become a terrible strain. You appear at times tired, distracted, febrile, free, febrile, right? Yes. Am I saying that right? Yeah. And yeah. agitated. And sometimes all of those things at once. It was a mistake for you to have ever moved out of home. While I approved of your decision to forgo marriage in order to spend more time with me, I did not inv- in- envisage? Never heard of it. Me neither. It would be this kind of company. Maybe a wife is what you need after all. Your kindly neighbor has informed me of your comings and goings from your rooms at all hours of the night. Does this mean there's a close relationship your mother doesn't, a close friendship your mother doesn't know about? I hope your taste in companionship has improved these past years, but I shall keep an open mind. I should like an explanation on all of this from you presently. Your loving and concerned mother. P.S. I hope you're eating and sleeping and taking Laugenum? Lau- Dr. Finkels gave you. That should improve your nerves. I'm going to see what that, what that is. Yeah, no doubt. Might be a plant. Laugenum. Uh, opioid containing opioid. 10% opioid. Pretty much it's just drugs. Like, like they yeah. all used to do back in the day. Back in the day. Not current. Nope. Wow. Edmund, Edmund. You got some issues, my man. Is there anything else I can look at? No, I don't want to pick up the stranger. I'll put him down. I don't want him. I will take the Kentucky bourbon. You're a weirdo, dude. Oh, look. All kinds of notes right here, too. Excuse me, sir. Oh, wow. He keeps everything. Mm -hmm. Nope, I can't. A murder. Oh, he keeps the whatever it's called. You can't read it. Uh, a murder mystery. Discovered another something case. Okay, well. And then look, I, I noticed this earlier. This girl who went missing. Jeez. Anything else? Yeah. And you're all those guts. I know. I was just thinking about Jeez. All right, mister. Let's go. You freak. No doubt. Yeah. Worse than that. Mm-hmm. Well, what do you think I should call him? What he is, a murderer. Oh, okay. I thought you were going to have to do a Or Psycho something. would be good. That is good. Psycho. Very fitting. Yeah. I'm going to put you where my horse is pooping, so I bet you're going to smell some poop right now. <laughs> yeah. He deserves worse than that. Yes, he does. <laughs> Perfect, because we were going to Valentine anyway. Nice. So, now we can buy a little jacket. Kill two birds, one stone. Yeah, I actually don't want to kill any birds today. Oh, so. no. Well, then let's not use a stone. Yeah. Don't pick up any stones. Uh, I won't. Hi, y'all. I tell you this place is cursed. I tell you this place is cursed. Why? All right. That jolted me. Remove stranger. All right, let's go. Found that fella you were looking for. Which fella? Yeah. Put him down. Put him down. Fella been, been. Well, it ain't nothing nice. Arthur, tell him what he's been doing. Disappeared over the past few years. This sick son of a bitch. Well, he ain't right in the head. That's so. Uh, head over to the cellar of that broke-down shack on the road to the falls. See for yourself. Okay, come on, Eve. My name is Edmund. Edmund Lowry, Jr. And you'll remember that, my friend. I'm sure I shall. Well, you are a frightening fella. Oh, I'll behave, sir. I'll behave as expected. Well, you better. And I'll get you a lawyer. Don't you worry about that. You get in that cell, come as you be. Oh my gosh. Get him off me! Please. 
Should I shoot him? Yes. But don't kill him. That sucks. You have to kill him. That's so annoying. He deserved to suffer. I know. I agree. You okay? Oh, oh thank you. Thank I feel you. like Arthur could have just grabbed him, but... My lord. What a monster. Yeah. Well, like I said, have someone head up to his cabin. Uh, I think he killed quite a few. Uh, oh, there's a lot of sick uh -huh. bastards out there. Here. Here. Here's some money for your trouble. How much do you think it's going to be? Thank you, sir. Um, 40 bucks. Now I think it's going to be a hundred. Oh, what? nice. Oh, God. What? 20 bucks. You're right. Good job, Mom. Why are you 40. freaking out? Hey. What a mess. Forgive me, officer. Shit. You know where Careful. to put it. When you're okay, I'm just leaving because everyone's being real aggressive in here. Yes, they are. Okay, look, let's go investigate this little question mark. See what the hell is going on in the back of this. Looking in people's windows. What has become of Arthur? I don't know. I'm not seeing anything that crazy. What am I supposed to be finding? You found a hidden operation. You can rob the shop, the shop side business. Okay. There a reason you don't want to see in your face? Hey, watch it. I'm sorry there. Move. Okay. What I want to do while we wait for the shop to open is I think we should take a little bath. Oh, good. I was hoping you so do that. Arthur's a little dirty and stinky. Uh, I can't get lucky do with business with again. anyone with a mask on. Uh, I think he's going to get a new lady. You think so? Yes. Maybe no lady at all. Oh. He can bathe himself. You with the ball Take that mask off. Oh, 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 they're mad at me taking it. Have my mask. I'm sorry. I forgot I had it on. Bath time for Arthur. Oh, look how skinny he is. I know. Oh my god, you can see his bones. Arthur. Uh, scrub head. Get that dirty head. Yeah. I look like I got one. Would you like any assistance? I think you need ex yeah, assistance, okay. Arthur. Sure. Let's see. New lady, same lady. Good. Now, don't you worry one? about that. I think it is. I can't remember. It looks like it. Yeah. When I remember. Okay, ma'am. <gasps> you let me know if you need anything, all right? Okay. Same move from last time. I know. Must be the same lady. Yep. She was excited to see that Arthur was coming back. Okay, all right, I think that should do it. It's so weird that she kisses him after see the bath. Then. I know. Arthur needs that. He needs a little loving. Yeah, he does. Oh, Arthur, fucking take your mask off. What are you doing? Let's see how clean his face is if it looks healthy oh, Okay, or then. Okay, then. Let's get him in front of some of the nice, you know, beautiful light. Yeah, he looks much better. Much better. And this whole time, I was like, God, Arthur looks awful. It's because he was freaking filthy. Freaking filthy. You need to take more baths. I do. Okay, I'm leaving. Well, Arthur knows. Yes, yes, not me, Arthur. Okay, let's go talk to this doctor. And rob the salon business. Howdy. New in town? Where are you? I don't see I you. only keep select items you on really the shelves. Fix them to Gum me. and candies behind the shelf. Oh, just, okay. And the medicine and tonics are on the table against the wall. See the catalog if you can't find what you're looking for. What do you want? This is private. Get lost. That's it. You get out huh. now. Interesting. What's going on? Relax, friend. Am I gonna get in trouble if I aim my weapon at him? Hey, put that damn gun down. Let Just... me into that back room of yours right now. 
Sir, please. You don't want to get involved with them, I promise you. You make them open up, or you're a dead man. Hey, uh, open up. It's me. I uh, brought some food and whiskey for you, fellas. Poor doctor, I feel bad. Mm -hmm. I think his wife's yeah, cheating on him. It's only the duck. <gasps> it's the freaking O'Driscolls. Don't oh. try anything funny. Thought you were that cowpoke who bothered us earlier. Put it on the table. Looks like a nice little business you got. On the table. You ah! Fuck you! I don't want to kill you. Sorry. There you go. At least you didn't kill him. Yeah. And steal. Now you want Let me steal all my stuff. There's a where you were just a hero. I know, right? Oh, what? I can't freaking s rob a business. No oh, hair tonic. Nice. Shit. The move. Okay, well, I will come out with my hands up in a minute. Give me a mat. Okay, Arthur, come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We don't have time. Come on. Oh, that's, I can't pick it up. Okay. What is it, coupons? <laughs> <laughs> coupons for drugs. There you go. What the hell happened here? Hey, stand. Ah, Fuck! I did not want to do that! Frickin' frack. Shoot. You are so wanted. This did not go as I planned. No, it did. Ooh, good jump, Arthur. Crapola. Oh god, I'm gonna go down for this. Maybe uh, nice. Guys, can you leave me alone? What if I what if I surrender? Can you really not shoot me? Ah! Arthur, put your gun away, please! Oh. No, I'm done! I want to surrender! Please, let me surrender! I'm done, okay? I think it's too late for that. Literally, it's too late. You guys suck. Why didn't you just kill him? Because there were so many of them, and it makes your uh, bounty go higher, so... Oh, does it? Yeah. God, what a little snitch the doctor is, huh? I know. To go back there and be like, fuck you, bitch, you made me die. A hundred and forty-eight dollars. What, for your bounty? Mm-hmm. I thought you had to go to a certain place to pay for that. Well, maybe not for my bounty, but for dying. Let's see. So we saw Como Driscoll hang. Did we already see that? I thought we did. Um... As his boys lined up to spring him, we dealt with them. Dutch back to being himself, at least that for a moment. Sadie, like a dog with a bone, she ain't done with him yet, I imagine. Wonder if this will calm Dutch down and he can get back to survive. We can get back to surviving ourselves than just killing them. We despise. I don't feel too much. Bastard wanted to kill me, but he didn't want to do, didn't want to that much. And I guess I felt about the same. He weren't ever exactly my fight. And now my fight is real different with a different enemy, one I cannot see nor put a bullet into. Him and his boys was our fault, all right? But did we ever exist or were we just a group of individuals, each just fallen for Dutch's dumb bluster? I feel like I don't know nothing no more. The whole life of certainty's over. Wild carrot. My whole code that I lived and, lived and killed by, was it true or was there a bigger truth? I was too dumb to ever see. I don't know what you're talking about, Arthur. Saw Mr. Mason again. This time he was taking pictures of wolves, still doing his hardest to get himself eaten. Mm. 
found the murderer, a man named Edmund Lowry. Took him to the sheriff in Valentine. After he nearly killed me, he jumped the sheriff. I killed him, nasty bastard. He was. Okay. Up to date. Now. Oh, my God. I need to eat some. Look at my freaking. No wonder Arthur's skinny. I know. You're not feeding him. I just fed him right now. Where'd you feed him? I don't know. Pork. Plain pork. Unseasoned pork. I don't remember you killing a pig. I bought a bunch of stuff from the store last oh, okay. week. Yeah, okay. Now let's go buy some yeah. stuff. Oop. Move it. Oh, someone's saying, where the heck am I? Hey, what's up, mister? Hey there, pal. Can you help me? Yes. Could you use some help finding my way home? I can't make heads or tails of where I'm at. <laughs> I live in front of the saloon next to the freight station. You know if I'm heading in the right direction? Oh, it's just Sure, sure. Just head over that way. You'll get home fine. Thank you, mister. Certainly do appreciate it. Certainly do. Coming from a good time, huh? Thanks again, mister. He's a nice drone. Just drop that pan on the ground. Ooh, didn't Welcome. mean to do that. Sorry. Got everything you need. Have a look. I sure hope you do. I got. I need a winter coat. Hello, partner. You look like you dropped some weight there. Yeah, a bit. I want to pass by Doc Calloway while you're in town. <laughs> Maybe. How about you just shut Thanks. the hell up and fucking sell me stuff? That was mean. That was uncomfortable. I feel bad. He was just being nice. No, he wasn't saying that I look skinny. He was making a fact. Coats. Let me get a nice winter coach. Oh, is this it? Oh, no, here we go. Okay. Um, let us look at... Can I do index? Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry. I meant, like, I want to see a whole list of everything, you know? Yeah. What if we found a nice winter outfit, actually? Sorry, I'm just thinking things. Nothing wrong with that. There we go. We'll go to outfits. Okay, and then try on view. Okay, and then let's see. This is hot temperatures. Okay, all outfits. Here we go. Nothing seems like it's for cold temperatures. No, it doesn't. But I like the long check or the dusters, I guess they're called. Shit. Yeah. Uh, let's try that again, shall we? So. Let's see this one, maybe. Hot temperatures. Okay. That one's cool. Hot temperatures. It's all not, It's none of it's yeah. for cold. Okay, so. Let's try this one on, and then we'll see all coats. Oh, that one looks like a winter jacket, yeah, maybe. Yeah, it does, for sure. Um, select. Okay, are you not going to tell me if this is for cold? Not sure. Hmm. Mm, it's on sale. Yeah, it is on sale. That's true, actually. Probably because, I don't know. Will that keep me warm? I sure hope so. I don't want to die. It looks like it would. You think so? Maybe I'll buy some gloves. Yeah, no doubt. All gloves. Let's see which ones will keep me the warmest. It literally doesn't matter. You get some with fingers in. I hate it when they Yeah, room. me too. I don't like... Your fingers have to freeze with them out. I know. It's so silly. A little fingerless glove. We'll buy that because it matches the best. Okay, I think Arthur's ready to go. Any warm hats I can put on? Nope, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's see if there's a warm hat for Arthur's, Arthur's little noggin. God, his eyes are red. God, no. These hats are horrible. Yeah, I think I'm just going to stick with our normal hat. I think so, too. Okay. All right, let's leave. All right, Arthur, I sure hope it keeps you warm. Cutie patootie, you. Bye. Now, 
Let's have a look. We'll be here if you end up needing something. Thanks. Ain't you causing enough trouble around here? Shut the frick up, bitch. You best watch your mouth. That's supposed to be I'm talking. You want to fight? I'm uh, so mad, I tell you. Uh, hey, man, uh, uh, he attacked me first. It's over for you now. Get up now. All right, come on then. Damn, you're fucking me up. You need to cut it out. Bitch. You're going to die. Shoot him, not me. Oh, honey, I don't want to take you out. I love you. Goodbye. Oh, no. Yep. Be Where's Mr. Flacco Hernandez? You really? You're not gonna let me? Oh, I'll just mark like right here then. Is it far away? Yes. Ooh, we need to be far away from this. Yes, ma'am. Ah, uh, okay. Honey, stop following me. Take you. Alright. Come on. You convinced me. Oh, right. Is there a road? I don't fucking see a road here. I don't need it. Oh my god! Oh my god, honey. Sorry. Okay, they're backing off the side. Probably gonna arrest my horse. Probably. That would be interesting. My bounty's only thirty dollars. That's not too bad. Nothing. You can have worse. Yeah, yeah. Much worse. Yeah. All right, Mr. Flocka Hernandez. I hope this is a warm enough jacket to come visit you. If not, we'll be taking yours. I was gonna say, if not, I will no longer be visiting you. Don't hug your Whoa. Let's slow her down, shall we? Oh, there's the there's the road right there. Oh, oh wow, this is steep. Yeah, this is a little scary. And on ice. All right, okay. girl. Oh my god, you're really making me nervous. Yeah, that's my girl. Oh, that was sweet. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you good, girl? <laughs> my god, no, no, no! Oh my god. That was scary. You're all right now, girl. I know. I know. I'm sorry. Okay. You're a brave girl. Aww, so sweet. God. Flaco Hernandez, why the F do you live up here? Am I at least close? OMG, we're oh. not even close. Wow. Are you joking right now, mister? There you go, take a deep breath. We're gonna be running in a while. Yeah. Oh, we're here! Oh, yay! Thank goodness gracious. Yep. See, that wasn't too bad. I, almost, no, I only died almost once. It wasn't as long as I thought it was gonna be. Me too! I was like, oh god. The man standing right there, waiting for your arrival. You're in the wrong camp, stranger. I don't mean no harm, okay? Just want to speak to Hernandez. We don't take to visitors up here. Kill this fool. Please don't. Drop ah! me in the fucking house. Thrill. Hopefully none of those were flock of Hernandez. No! Don't tackle me, please! That's good. Oh, no, maybe not. Nope. Oh, I keep shooting. No, no, no. Arthur, you're about to die. Okay, I think we're good. What happened out there? Hey, what's up?
What's up? Eighth coming down. Blacko Hernandez, you in there? I didn't want trouble, but I'm just here to speak with you. About Boy Calloway? Who is Boy Calloway? He's Come the gunslinger that we've been asking everyone about. Ooh, he's oh, he's cool looking. <laughs> well, he's freezing. Yeah, looks like it. King Calloway. I just want to talk about Boy Calloway. Sure. Here's your message. Oh, fuck. Damn. Oh, wow. I think you could hear it. Oh, yeah. I'm terrible at this. I'll never understand it. I just don't get it. I feel like I'm doing it right. Slowly fill the meter. Sorry, Mr. Hernandez. What was the point of coming and seeing him? I know, all of them have died, I think. Oh, except for, um, what's her face? Black Widow? Not Black Widow, but whatever her name was. Hmm. Black Widow sounds like a superhero. Yeah, it is. She's, uh... Okay. It looks like he's just sleeping. This is perfect. Should I do it like this or zoom in? I think that's not good. It's perfect. Like that? Yeah. Like that? It's in rain more. There you go. Okay. Um, how do I do it? Boom. Oh wait, enable. Oh, okay. Well, whatever. It doesn't matter. You shouldn't complain. Okay. Let's see if you got anything good, Mr. Hernandez. I wish I could take a coat. It's sick. Oh, Flacco's. I can actually. I can take his revolver. I hate when I do that. Can you take his coat? No, I can take his revolver though. I was gonna say. Oh really? How did he lock the door? Perfect. But you unlocked it. Yes, ma'am. Oh, look at this little, a little lock box. Oh, actually, let me do first person. Put your gun away, Arthur. You look silly. You're gonna shoot a lock box? No, I'm gonna open it. I know, I'm just teasing. Oh, we got a funny lady, yeah. huh? We got jokes. I didn't realize. Ooh, a map. You know what? Someone did tell me there was um, a treasure map. Thank you for the lovely stuff, Mr. Hernandez. Anything good around camp? We should all move up here, me and my family. You know, my camp, yeah. my fa camp family? Yep. Oh, look, he's got a little lockbox too. Gorgeous, he's absolutely gorgeous. Nice, nice. Ammunition. No ice. What'd you say? Ammunition. Yes, ma'am. All right, so let's start a little can a little fire. <sighs> you can't Nothing use the fire with already headset. I don't know. I don't think so. No, it's two fire drawers. Don't make me yawn. Don't. You made me yawn. That was effed up. Oh look, I'm in my little tent. So cute. Look at him just enjoying himself. Smile, Arthur. He's like, I'm too cold. <laughs> Way too cold for that. Uh, fast travel. All right, we're going home. Nice. Beaver Hollow, baby. And then we're going to donate some food to camp finally for the first time in like, well, actual food. Because I think I donated like some snake skin last last time I played. So Big whoop. Look at us getting our side missions done. I know. We're very productive today. The ones we didn't want to do, they're pretty cool, huh? Yeah. I'm so happy we found the serial killer. I know. I kind of not gave up, but I was like, I guess we'll find him at some point. Yeah, we did finally. I come bearing food for my family. No, I want to read my journal. Let's see, we got a new entry, huh? Probably. You're like, I don't want to fucking read my journal. <laughs> Found Vlaco Hernandez for that silly book. Killed him. Bastard jumped out of the way, but I still got him. Didn't seem like the type I was gonna befriend anyway. <laughs> no, definitely not Arthur. So let me question. Let me let, let me let, let me ask you this. Is it, yep, there he is, Jim Boy Calloway. I got it. I gotta go back to Valentine. I'll do that another day. I'm not doing that right now. Sue me. Here she. Okay. Wow, that's not looking good. I apologize in advance for this stew. It needs better meat. Good wolf, good wolf carcass. Nice. 
Really? Just well, guess. Time, Mr. Morgan. Wow, a whole wolf was enough. What about four wolf hearts? Well done, Mr. Morgan. Hmm, that's still not enough. Really? I know, right? That's what I'm saying. I, should I donate more? I guess so. What is this? Is this your food? Also? Yeah. So I'm oh. gonna. Good. We really needed this. One of these. Okay, I think it must be messed up. Because how am I donating this much and it's not doing anything? Thanks, Screw yeah. you, Pearson. Hey, Abigail. Hey, Abigail. And work on that stew while you're at it, Pearson. <laughs> yeah. Come on, does anyone want to talk so I can eavesdrop? Hi, Karen. You okay? Uh, Karen? Here we are, sir. Yes, ma'am. Hi, Tilly. Hey, Tilly. Arthur. Oh, wait, we have stew right now? I think Arthur actually needs some. I'm sure he does. Hey, Arthur. Hey, Mary Beth. That was nice. Everybody wants to eat. They ain't trying to talk. I know, literally. Sorry, Arthur. I know you just got back from, you know. I don't know. A mission? Yes. Alright, let's eat. How many, um, how many, like, bites do you think he's gonna take? Okay, wait, just Three. take one. Um, damn it, that's a good guess. I'll say four. Two. Does that count as three? Yes. Okay, good deal. Damn it, Arthur! So gluttonous. <laughs> Hello, Arthur. Hey. hey, Arthur. Yeah, now you can What's talk to wrong? me. What happened to loyalty, Arthur? I haven't even done anything yet. I keep asking myself the same question. You just worry about that cough. <gasps> uh oh. Oh. I can't even believe you would say that to me. That is so mean. I know. Very mean. Did you hear what he said to me? Arthur. Why do you say it like that? How are you coping? <laughs> Marvelous! We'll be alright. Okay, Arthur. Is he being mean to me too? I know, everybody's crabby today. Crabby or short. What the hell's going on, everyone? While you sit your lazy asses at camp, I'm actually out doing stuff, right? It benefits the camp. Yes! I just brought home a freaking whole wolf. Let's look around Dutch's stuff. Why haven't we seen Dutch lately? Because he's probably doing something stupid with Micah. Working on the pla- It's a part of the plan, Arthur. Oh, yes, it is. I hate you, Jose. I mean, oh, I don't know why I just said that. Wow. Sorry, Jose. I can't even believe you. I want to find someone else to talk to. Really? Where is everybody? Hi, I will be right back to talk to you, okay? I promise. What's my health looking like? Ooh, not good. Let's. This ain't fun no more. I know. Good evening. Okay, I'm getting How ignored. Are you doing? Everything's falling apart. What are we gonna do, Arthur? I'm just hang in there, okay? Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Hey, Bill. What's with you? Are you gonna throw me out like Strauss? Maybe, if it comes to it. Yep. Okay, guess I'll see you later then. <laughs> sure thing, Morgan. Guys, everyone's oh, being real mean to day. me. Hi. How are you holding up? I'm okay. How are you? You don't look so good. I'll be fine. Just worry about you and Jack. Uh -huh. John's like, what about me? Yeah. Hey, brother. Evening, Arthur. Oh, he called him brother. Any news? Nothing you don't already know. He said that the other day, too. Okay, see you later. Well, I'll leave you to it then. Let me talk to you, Mr. Pastor. Hi, Tilly. Oh. Hi. Can I talk to you? Sir? Hey, Reverend. Good evening to you, Mr. Morgan. Glad to see you've got your act together at last. I am trying. I'm really Be sad everyone's being mean to Arthur. Be well. 
Oh, he just told me to shut up, pretty much. Okay, everybody. Get your head out of the clouds. <gasps> Arthur! He just told me to get his head out of the clouds! Sit next to me no more. Damn. Fine, I'll fucking sit. Let's sit, bitch. After what you said to me? Why would I sit next to you? I mean, I will, but... I shouldn't. Well, I am honored. Sure. <laughs> you better lose Should it. I antagonize him? Yes. You need to open your eyes, Javier. I don't want to hear it, Arthur. Nope. You're too trusted. ¿Cuál es tu problema? What's your problem? It'll be your downfall. I'm not wasting any more time on you. God, I want to attack you. Okay. Now we're going to talk to our man, Trelawney. Hi. Josiah? Josiah. I, um, I was, uh... Leaving again? Yes, just leaving. I'll see you soon. There you are. Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. But I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Mm. Get out of here. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. No, no let's not get over sentimental. Well, the place is quiet. Get out of here. Go with my blessing. Thank you, Arthur. Why is he leaving? He always comes and goes, but I guess it's because, like, the, everything's going to shit, so he's like, I'm not sticking around for this. It seems permanent this time. Found a friend looking yeah. for you. Mr. Morgan. <gasps> hey. Sir. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can I help you? I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances and mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time he must want peace. Why could he possibly want to humiliate us further? We got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Uh, perhaps I could make one last request. My men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. But I feel with some non-tribe members present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Will you, Arthur? Of course I will. It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Do it for me? Of course. Charles, I've got... I've saved your life. Do it for me. Sure. Come on. You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiation. Let's go. Me and Charles going on a little mission yeah. again. Yeah, you're right. Where the hell is Bill and Dutch? I know. Up to no damn good. That's yep. where they are. Getting the um, camp in more trouble than necessary. Mm. Yes, ma'am. I also have some men meeting me there. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll get sure. up. Oh. Thank you for doing this, both of you. What's you it? have already done so much. Sorry. Ain't a problem. Just hope nobody recognizes me. I've had a few run-ins with the army recently. <laughs> I wish we could have done more to control the situation. That shouldn't have gotten involved. Now Eagle flies us under arrest. <gasps> it certainly oh, won't help dead. our case today. Yeah. I will find a way to help him. I promise you. I just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I am not asking for very much, but when our people are sick and hungry, and we find our medicine and supplies are being deliberately withheld, how can we not view that as something personal? When they destroy our sacred sites, how can I convince Eagle Flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Mm -hmm. Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. Be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. Of course, that's right. We will be at the meeting, and there's one person who knows the true situation, at least. I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. An agreement. Oh, my God. <gasps> Don't make fun of rainfalls. I'm sorry. I love rainfall. Me, too. He's a nice guy. 
I just renamed him Rainbow. I know, he took off the S at the end of his name. It's there for a reason, you know. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's like you're taking a letter off my name. Yeah, like calling you Charles. Yeah, Charles. That could be a guy's name. That could be. Charla. That's how some people yes. Charla. That's how some people pronounce it. That's really take off the S. I get called everything. You do. Yeah. You get called everything but the kitchen sink, right? Yes. That's not the same. No, it's joking. not. But I'll take it. You liked it? I liked it. I loved it. I want some more of it. I try so are. hard. There's my men up ahead. I thought you were going to oh. finish that off. Sorry. My voice Whoa. isn't as good as yours. We chose a killer now. Kola with Yumpy. Hilpo. Unyampi Ktelo. This way. Oh, sorry, Charles. I'm always bumping into you. Okay. On the same freaking oh wow we're doing everything the same that's so funny that's funny what's up y'all <sighs> colonel favors captain monroe we come in peace hello again who are these two? They're uh, friends of my people. Hmm. Interesting looking fellows. <laughs> you know, they won't cause any trouble. What? Well, I should hope not. <laughs> Listen, Mr. Uh... <coughs> Chief. Yes, uh, Mr. <gasps> I can't say that silly name. <laughs> wow. In English, they call me Rain's Fall. Yes, yes, I'm, uh... I'm sure they do. <laughs> Listen. We're all Americans here, and we want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, I am confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. Keep breaking peace treaties we've made, causing disturbances in everybody's lives. But I pride myself on being a gentleman. Really, I do. But there are limits. So, let me be very... Good. Are you okay, man? Someone. Jackson, take him away. Where was I? You're a gentleman with limits? Are you being facetious, sir? Come this way, buddy. I said, are you being facetious, Captain Monroe? No, sir, I am not. Chief Reigns. That's, uh, Reigns' fault. Exactly. Chief Reigns, the thing it's quite is, a cough. Sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. I'll, I'll be fine. Thank you. Oh, Arthur. God, that guy's such a freaking douchebag. No, I know. No. You know he's going to have Monroe court martialed. Or attempt to. He's going to make a disgrace of him. Monroe? He seems likable enough for a West Pointer. Why? You know what Favors is like. Because he thinks it's right. Because he thinks Monroe is a patsy. Or a spy. He's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen. He thinks Monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the Indians. So he removes Monroe. Who removes how? Favors wants him tried for treason. And hanged. Why does... Favors care about the Indians. Because he doesn't want to back down. I mean, his whole professional life. You know what they say about him. High tail Favors. The man who missed a battle. Poor Monroe. Kind of liked him. I know. Well, still, he's kind of stuck up. Your men violated the treaty. That treaty is null and void. I have been appointed to negotiate. Feeling better? Yeah. Come on. <coughs> Let's go. <coughs> the lands you currently occupy belong to the United States government. 
Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <clears throat> so I'm afraid the federal government was quite clear, Colonel, that it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Well, is that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Gross insubordination. Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Let him go. This is all getting out of hand. Hi, right. Captain Monroe, let's get out of here. Hi, if I, I were you, I'd keep my mouth shut, amigo. I don't want to kill this man, but shall. Don't get away with this. Charles, Captain Monroe, mount up now. We're getting out of here. Don't be dumb! You son of a bitch! Open fire on you! This way! And we out. Yup! Yeah. Oh, I don't my throwing knife. I don't think that'll work here. Mm -mm. Although nobody's coming after you so far. Very true! Poor Captain Monroe. Oh, here we go. Oh, hello. Wow. I can't shoot at these men. Oh, shoot the kid. Oh, 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 Scout, you see how you like it. Hold your fire. They ain't gonna hold their fire. Oh, we're getting off the horse. Okay, I didn't realize. Can you shoot? Ah, I can't do it. They're trying to kill you. I swore it off. Oh, he did You're a dead man now. Go ahead. Ah! I hit you. That's how you want to do it. Uh. Okay. Oh, I shot him in the elbow. Explosives or anything. My gosh, look at that pile of freaking people. Good lord. Oh, this guy. Let's get back to him. Yep, there we go. Wherever she is. There she is. Come on, honey. Hop on, Captain. We sure as hell don't want to hang around here. God, so many people. That's crazy. Oh, it is. Okay. 
Right. Let's get that horse for you, Not Captain. Really. What do we do now? You get out of here. Fast. Take you to the station. I can't believe that just happened. I've been an army man my whole life. I heard them talking. They was gonna have you hang for treason. You can't die for those fools. And what about the chief? We'll do what we can. I... Guess I won't be submitting my report. I wouldn't think so. Let's get you a new outfit. I think I got an extra one What's on my wrong, horse. Arthur? Oh. What's happening now? Hmm. Okay, there we go. I guess I think I messed up the cutscene a little bit. <laughs> um. <coughs> On accident. <laughs> Arthur! Get out of here, Captain Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, how much money is he going to give him? Probably 150. Yeah, 100. Here's some money. I don't know, it looks pretty thin. Get out of here. Maybe like 50. Start a new life somewhere. Arthur, give him a lot of money, please. Tahiti's nice. Thank you. <laughs> Just hop on a train to San Denis, jump on a boat. We'll avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. <laughs> Forget about it. They didn't show how much you gave him. He will, whenever I think we get Maybe out of the cup of <laughs> Morgan! <clears throat> hey! Are you okay? Well, never better. What are you doing here? I'm on my way down to Mexico. They're finally sending me on a mission. Oh, that's Brother nice. Dorkins is very jealous. <laughs> <laughs> mm, he's getting bad. Yeah, he is. What's wrong? I'm, uh, I'm dying, sister. Okay. Yeah, I got TB. I got it. Beating the man to death <clears throat> for a few bucks. <sighs> I've lived a bad life, sister. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. We all sin. But I know you. <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> Forgive me, but that's the problem. You don't know you. What do you mean? I don't know, but whenever we happen to meet, you're always helping people and smiling. I had a son. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy, well, I watched him die. And it weren't soon enough. My husband died a long time ago. Life is full of pain. But there is also love and beauty. Uh, what am I gonna do now? Be grateful that for the first time, you see your life clearly. <laughs> sure. Perhaps you could help somebody. Help him makes you really happy. That's all he does. <sighs> I know, seriously. But I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often, neither do I. <laughs> but then, I meet someone like you, and everything makes sense. <laughs> You're too smart for me, sister. <sighs> I guess I... I'm afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Morgan. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. All aboard. I shall try. I know you will. Goodbye, goodbye, Mr. Morgan. Get that train done. Goodbye. Sister. Sister. Poor Arthur. 
feel so bad for her. Doing run. You all right, girl? No. Oh, let me go pay my bounties. Be with you momentarily. Liberty is worth every penny. Thanks, Mister. Did you say thanks, Benjamin? <laughs> thanks, Mister. Oh. <laughs> thanks, Benjamin. Him? Oh, well, here he is. Here's our man again. And then we got... Oh, yeah, we got Hamish! <gasps> what is that? Weapons forbidden. Okay, let's go see what this guy's up to. Right next to us. Perfect timing. Way to show up, mister. Okay. Wow, literally two seconds away. I know that's nice. It is. Look, you can hang out with this horse. Drink water all you want. Oh, or, okay. Didn't tell you to. Okay. Look. Oh, wow. You're, is, there, is that a boy or a girl? Let's see. I don't know. It's a little horse. I was going to say. Oh, it's a girl. I was going to say. Oh, Midnight does not want to hang out next to that horse. So, you're still alive. Uh, Mr. Morgan. How are you? Indigestible, apparently. Aside from that, very well. How's the project going? Well, this is God's country, and I am his faithful servant, although perhaps not his most talented one. I have been trying to capture the grace of the wild horses here for weeks, only the buggers can't stand me. Ah. That is a silver dapple pinto. I know. Beautiful. Won't come anywhere near me, of course. He can smell my stupidity. <laughs> How about I drive him over? That might help. Can you be bothered? I feel like such a blunderer. Sure. Yeah, I'm Wait sure here. you do. At least this time I doubt I'll get eaten. <laughs> Maybe trampled. Possibly. Oh, look, this is such a beautiful day. I'd love to have a beautiful day like this where it's not too oh. sunny. I like it sunny. Oh, poop. I like it sunny, baby. Uh, yeah, but this would be a nice day to have like a picnic or something. You know, you're not going to get sunburned, maybe. Yeah. You know, you just get to sit outside. Maybe it's warm. Maybe it's cold. I don't know. Maybe breezy, that's what we really want. Yeah. A little bit of breeze. Yeah, a little breeze. Nice. Oh, careful. Um, beautiful big tree. Alright, you wild shunch of bitches. Ooh, did that just did I just hurt myself? Let's go! Get up! Careful. Oh, he's hitting himself. I thought he was hitting uh, midnight. No, I think he hit his thigh. Come on. Come on, horses. Come on, horses. Yeah. God, I almost trampled that one. Okay, let's go this way, I think, guys. Come on. Look pretty doing it. <laughs> Come on. You want your likeness taken? Go then! Move. You want your what taken? Likeness taken. <laughs> like your picture taken. I think that's what he means. Oh, okay. Good to know. Well, excuse no, me. Yeah, 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 go on. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Uh-uh. Yes. Well, that's a beautiful horse. Wow. Midnight. Oh, you're about to get kicked to the curb, I fear. He should have got him. Doo doo doo. Come on, take a picture of my freaking horse. She's gorgeous. You are a genius. I thought he was no, about to die. No, but I can ride a horse. Well, in my world, that makes you a <laughs> genius. You're too kind. <laughs> so, how are the uh, photos coming along? Oh, amazing. Here, I have a print of the wolves before they try to eat us. It's for you. That's real oh. fine. Well, thank you. Take care, Mr. Mason. You too, sir. You too. See you later, mister. 
Inspect document. Oh, that's not my horse. Sorry. I was going to say, what are you doing? Okay. I'm sorry. You don't even recognize Midnight well, anymore? Well, excuse me. Mis mistakes aren't allowed when you're around, huh? That's right. That yep. was twice as little as and, Midnight. And Midnight's freaking silver. Yes. Um, that makes a big difference. <laughs> Let me drink some alcohol. You're stressing me out. Yeah. <laughs> you're driving me to drinking. All right. That's my Ooh. goal. That's fucked up, Mom. Oh, it's waning. It's raining. It's pouring. The old man is snoring. He woke up and bumped his head and couldn't get up in the morning. Nice. Thank you. Mm. Look at Midnight's tail just slowly going. Now it's fast. Okay, so I think that since it's raining, that means that... Oh, I figured what's his face's mission would be available up here. Maybe it has to be like pouring rain? Why wouldn't it have to be pouring rain? Because I need to go see Mr. Marco Dragic, but someone said that his um his machine or something is the reason that it's raining all the time and oh. stuff like that. So I'm assuming that means it's only available at certain times, you mm. know? Good to know. Well let me just wait a minute, you know, for it to really pour. And then I'll try, you know? Know what I mean, yeah, Joe Green? I know what you mean. You better get out of here, mister. It's not showing up yet. Yep. Mark of Dragic. Yeah! Yeah! I really like that horse. Okay, can I just be honest? You should be honest. Thank you. Is it over here? Maybe I'll try to catch it. You like this weather? Storm Yes, weather I do. Here? If I'm home, heck yeah, I yeah, love this weather. Yeah, I do at home. Not when you're not at work. No, not when I have to I don't mind it if I'm at work, as long as I don't have to drive. Yeah. Yeah, because, yeah. Yeah, because, yeah. I don't know where that beautiful horse went, so. Oh, I scared them all off. Oh, that's not a horse. Nope, don't want my satchel either. I'm not getting drunk. Oh! I just kicked the shit out of midnight. Huh, I really wanted to go up here and see. What's his face? Okay, so. Who are we closer to? Oh, we're like kind of right in the middle, huh? Do you want to go see Jim Boy Calloway or Hamish Sinclair to finish this off? Hamish. Okay. Alrighty then. <gasps> What's going on here? Hey, you ain't got no business being here. What are you doing? Oh, don't mind me. Oh yeah, real clever. Get out of here, fool. Hey, what are you doing there? Is this your dumb way of looking for trouble? Get away from me. Uh, uh. Bitch. Ah. I'm gonna loot you now, too. Because whatever you're doing seems illegal. I think that guy's dead, so probably no, looks very illegal. Mm. Yeah, but it doesn't say, brain. it just, oh my god, yeah, I yeah, pick him up. You gotta pick him up? I don't know. I'm just trying to see what's going on with him. I'd like to put him back down. Yeah, I would too. Oh! Arthur. You're a bad man, Arthur. Anything I can do here? Literally no. I don't know what that was. How weird. All right, get the hell out of here. Get out! Yeah. Don't kick me. Yeah. Okay, let's go. You gotta go. That horse wants to stay around here? Yeah. And I don't care, right? That's right. Did your part. Yep. Maybe the owner was super nice. I don't think so. He was playing with the dead body. Oh, I thought it might be the dead body's horse. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Maybe no, it was. Oh, so he's hanging out. He's like, I can't leave my man. We're near camp. Oh, yeah, I guess the Hamish does need to live near camp. Oh. I didn't know that. Yes. Yeah. Holy moly, look at that big guy. Look at him, he's huge. Look at him. Oh, he is. Wow. Hi, Buell, you pretty boy. May I? May I approach? No. You're okay. 
He's like, yeah, it was okay before you were touching me. <laughs> okay. Horses always get pissed off after I touch them. I know. Do 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 do. Hamish. Arthur. <laughs> Arthur. Come in. Okay, I will. You said uh, we could go for a hunt. I did. There's this huge she-wolf been stalking oh, me the last few nights I've been out, but she can wait. Oh, okay. Let's talk a while. Sure. Oh, okay. Let's talk. So what do you do? Uh, me? Uh, I'm a wanderer. I was born further north, but I spent a lot of time out west. It's funny. I never saw myself as a wanderer, man. Oh, that's nice. I guess yeah. it's like they're just talking for so yeah. long. The bodies lay so thick. Oh. They could have walked across the whole field oh, without your the, boots touching mud. Those were bad times. Mm. Yes, they were. Would you like some more coffee? Please. <gasps> <-wee>. <laughs> what have we oh. here? Yeah. She's right across there. Well, why don't we just let, let her live? Oh, 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 oh. Well, I guess. She's acting brazen. Come on. Let's mount up. She could kill Buell in the middle of the yeah. night. She could. We don't want that, do we? Nope. Come on. We're friends with her. She went around to the left. Around the lake. Down here somewhere. You with me? Come on. I'm right here. Wolves shouldn't come so close to people. Yeah, it's strange. When the whole country was wild, they could go where they liked. Now they're stuck hiding in the few corners of wilderness we got left. It's a feeling with which I can sympathize. This ain't a country for wild animals, Sorry. nor wild men, neither. Not anymore, it seems. You hear that? Yep. Quickly. Let me get one of my guns. I don't even freaking have my gun out. Ooh, let me do my bow and arrow. This way. Up there. On the outcrop. You see her? Let's go around it. Okay, I'm with you. We're on to her. Come on. Okay. Come on, yeah. This is giving me flashbacks of the mission with Hosea. Is it? Damn! Yeah. I can't see her. Let's get up to the top. Have a look around from up there. Okay. Mew loves hills, don't you, boy? You eat them up for breakfast. What we got here? Is that a fresh kill? Could be. Is the blood set? Let me take a look. <laughs> yep. That was her dinner. She didn't eat much of it. Yep. Now, where'd she get to? Why don't you just use your eagle eye and find her? Nice. Tell him. Thank you. My guess. She's gone somewhere over there. No, there's a whole lot I was lot just going to say that. That's the yeah, problem. Yeah, I know. There she is. Got shy all of a sudden. That'd be hard to shoot with you. You got some extra water. Chaser. Let's chase her. What? All so you right. can't just shoot her? Why aren't we just shooting her? Maybe she's too far away. Maybe. Quick! Why we got eyes on her? Okay, cool. Damn it! Too slow! It looks like she's headed into the woodland. We're gonna have oh, to track her through the scrub. Better to be on foot. Send your horse somewhere safe. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a wolf about. He didn't send his horse. <laughs> you went in there, all right. Okay, Buell. We got a tracker. Now you want to take the lead, or shall I? Uh, I can do it. You're an old man. No offense. Uh, lead. Come up. If you don't mind. Glad to. Okay, get tracking. I'll be close behind you. I got the trail. This way. 
Right behind you. We can get slow. I'll take it slow, okay? You see anything yet? Just tracks. We heading down here? What did you say? You hidden down here? Oh. Are we hidden down here? Hey, mission, I'm trying to focus. We don't get her. Well, what's the worst that can happen? She runs off with the chicken. Well, I'm fine with losing chickens. Lost a leg already. And I gotta pull down my pants to shit in these woods. Yeah. Oh. Complete and unconditional. Yeah, I don't think the wolves would have shown much mercy. That's quite an ambush she let us into. Yeah, bushwhacking, I'd call it. Huh? God damn! Over here! Over here! No! There, no way. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Hey, man, Hamish. <laughs> Best of them. Look at them. Proud thing. Scary thing. <laughs> they brought us here to be slaughtered. You were after a hunt. Yeah. Yeah, and I guess I got hunted. <laughs> you going back to the cabin? Yeah, nah. Still early. We'll stay up here a while. Dress this animal. I won't likely see another like him for some time. Yeah, I hope I won't <laughs> either. Thanks for taking me out. Yeah, anytime. You want to go out again? Yeah. You come by and see me. So long, then. Yeah. Wait. Here's a pelt. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you earned it. So long. You can't take the meat off one of them? Oh, I'm going to. <laughs> um, let me see. Oh, now Marco Dragic is available. Is it because I'm up here? Where am I? Am I here? No, kind of, I guess. Roanoke Valley. Oh, really? God, that's scary. Thieves. Okay. Out. Oh my god, I just lost a hundred and something dollars. Okay, let's watch. Nope. Let's read our journal. See what's new. Things went from bad to worse with the army. I was not wrong. The local regiment's colonel despised Captain Monroe and planned to destroy him. Charles and I rescued Monroe and probably ruined his life in the process. I hope he can find some peace some, someday. <coughs> After putting him on the train, I bumped into the nun, Sister Caldron, bound for Mexico because she gave me a few home truths about existing in this world and perhaps the next. Maybe I got something to hope for. Anyway, it all sounded very pretty and took away the 
dread I was feeling. Aww. Help Mr. Mason take another picture, this time wild horses. He gave me a beautiful print of the wolves that nearly ate him. Hamish and I got to chatting, then we went hunting this wolf he's been after. Only we suddenly realized the bastards were hunting us, not the reverse. Eventually I got the pack leader and they let us be. A real lucky escape. Nice pelt though. <gasps> I what? lost I lost the pelt because I died. Oh no. Damn it! That sucks. That's so annoying! Stupid people who freaking hey, robbed me! Wow, fancy house, huh? Totally. Looks like a business. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, I'll go around the back then. Seems like a helicopter. Mm -hmm. oh, that's right. What the hell? We're okay. Hello? Anybody here? Hello? If you are here to rob me, I wish to make clear that I have weapons that could liquefy each of your internal organs in turn and leave you just a puddle on the floor. Professor, I ain't here to rob you. It's me. I am. Um... I helped you at the pond. You did. Oh, you did. <laughs> In the buffoon. <laughs> Hello. Oh my gosh. Hello. What a compliment. I hope I'm not disturbing you. Of course you are disturbing me, buddy. I almost solved biggest problem and you mess it up. Did? No, but I did. I can't get the bloody conductor straight. Well, well, it, it is uh, the geometry of life, uh, the grand theory of uh, power. <laughs> it's the grand theory of theories. <laughs> uh, there is just one more big problem. <laughs> Maybe I solve it, but I can't get it right. I don't understand. Of course you don't. Help me adjust these things, and I will show you what I mean. Here, take these. Oh, well. They're pretty, whatever they are. Mm -hmm. Scientist. Yeah, well, you are an American. <laughs> Science is far beyond you, but you make a, a fine buffoon. Go. You have the detector in your hand. The filament flashes when it points at the location for conductors. So, oh, okay. no help there. Oh, 
here we go. Okay, now it's telling me. I had to think. under the lamp. <laughs> Alright, Arthur. We're scientists now. I know. We're ready for that or without. Yes, ma'am, we are. Arthur's a brave guy. He is. As brave as he is handsome. Oh, okay. What'd you think I was going to say? Did I scare you? I didn't know. This is to school so I had a clue what was going on. What well, now? Well, now I become the second creature after God himself to bring life to this earth. Like. Oh my God. What? Am I missing something? Ah. Uh, the switches, the bloody switches. Okay, uh, climb up there and adjust them for me. Wow. Go quick, please. Arthur has to do everything. Jesus, yeah. What would he have done if I was going to come along? Exactly. Come on, let me come there. Okay. Oh, there we go. There we go. I'm supposed to climb it. No, okay, thankfully there's a ladder. Okay, good. I was a little nervous. Me too. Which side do I get on? This side? God damn it. What I got myself into. Yeah, seriously. Come on, Lenore. Ooh, that's high up. Mm hmm. And it's raining and thundering and lightning and yes. there's metal. Everything's slippery. Me twice. Yeah, really. My life's work. Is this gonna be Frankenstein? Incredible. Oh wow! Watch. What is it? 
It is life itself. Morons who doubted me. It is me and you. Creation's second birth. That was pretty cool. Yeah. I just saw yeah. a machine waddle a few steps. I have a son. I am the luckiest man alive. I those morons! They doubted me. I'll see you later. Yes. <laughs> yes. Goodbye. Damn, Mars is like, alright, this guy's crazy as fuck. That was cool actually. Yeah, it was. Let's go home, honey. That was a long whistle, Arthur. Sorry, but we're feeling lazy. We don't want to ride home. No, we don't. We're just gonna fast travel. Oh, I'm in legendary animal territory. All right. I like his jacket. Yeah, I do too. I like his other outfit better, but... We'll change into that next time, okay? Makes him look bigger than he is. He's so skinny underneath it. <laughs> he ate three bars of chocolate today, okay? Okay, wow. He's gonna really gain weight then. Yeah. Oh, I love the way the camp is loading in right now. It's gorgeous. Thank you. Okay, you just gotta say... Oh, and the journal again, huh? Jeez. Okay. Went to see the professor at his lab. He had built a sort of mechanical sun. He seemed to think it was amazing, but we could not get the thing to work properly. I was half as impressed with him as he was with himself. I was not half as impressed with him as he was with himself. Okay. Okay. Let me just talk to a few people at camp. What time is it? Is everyone asleep? See if everybody's in a better mood. They're not going to be. I'm going to antagonize everybody. Well, not everyone, but no, what is this? Oh, Miss, what's her face? Kim Shaw. See if we can get through a morning. What are you our... doing? Oh, something with the water. Okay. What do you think we should do? Oh, she's gonna say. Yeah. He has a lot of pressure on him. Don't forget all he's done. Okay, for bye. You. Okay, I'm not gonna bother Pearson. These are the girls. I'm not gonna bother them. Damn, no covers. Uh-uh. Must be cold. Who's this? Who's that? Oh fuck. My you think you're yeah. so clever, don't you? Arthur, you already now, said don't this. Don't get yourself all worked up. But I see exactly what you're doing. He already said this. Why do you let yourself get so head up? Shut up. I don't wanna hear it. You're a snake. You wait. Antagonize. Should I antagonize Bill or greet Bill? Um, antagonize her friend. William's in on guard duty. God help us. You best watch your mouth. You're about as sharp as a bag of socks. <sighs> Why are you being an asshole? Well, at oh. least you still appear Don't to be, be a awake. person. This ain't funny now. William's in on guard duty. God help us. Ah, who do you think you are? What's going on? Damn, I really riled him up. Yeah, you did. Hey, I'm only trying to improve the mood a bit. Improve the mood. Yeah, somebody needs to. All right, I'm going to go over now to... I think this is Javier. Let's antagonize him a bit while he's sleeping. <laughs> That's antagonizing by itself. Wait, it's a stranger. Who the fuck are these? Who is this? Hey. Get up. What? Who are you guys? Sorry. Just feel like I need to shake things up around here. Just go away. Who is this? What? You didn't even tell us. Who's this? Maybe if you antagonized him, you would. Stop sleeping. <laughs> you uh, dumb as what, you look. Arthur? 
Who the hell do you think you are? No. Sounds like you're even dumber. You got a problem with me? I'm trying to sleep here. Who are you? Just lose the tough act. I'm done with this now. Nobody wants you here, partner. Son of a bitch. Who in the hell? Javier, who is this? That's crazy. It is crazy. What the heck? Wow. This maybe these are new people. It camp, I guess. Oh god. Yes, sir. That's probably bad news. Probably freaking Micah's friends. They're good. Oh look, look, look. There's Doug. He's sleeping. Later. Can't wake him. Let me get my binoculars. Herbert. Okay. I see his hand. It looks like he's up. Okay, now this is me. Oh, almost there. Yep, he's hey, not like, like. <laughs> They're like, oh my god, Arthur's fucking lost it. He has. He's being a freaking pervert. Well, I can't wait to meet our new camp members. We didn't have a very yeah, good first. I was going to say, they seem real nice. Yeah, they do. Well, good morning, John. I do want to see if they're going to get up. Well, they're sleeping. Whatever. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Or next time we play. Which will be there tomorrow. Yes. Uh, Sleep. Okay. Well, it's morning time. Damn it. Always, Arthur. You can sleep till noon, though. You handsome man, you. All right. Say goodnight. Bye, Arthur. Bye. Good sleep, sweet, sleep, sweet, 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 sweet dreams. <laughs> Arthur no, wants, no, no, no. Arthur wants whatever you're smoking. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so a lot happened. Yes. Uh, what was your favorite part? Um, Sadie and the, uh, her part. Yeah, I guess. I guess that was probably one of my favorite parts too. I liked honestly all of that we did. Yeah. You know, like there wasn't a part where I was like, oh, like we. Oh my god, no! I'm sorry. There's no way in hell, the serial killer. Oh yeah. I forgot we found. I was gonna yeah. say I feel like something really big happened. Right. But yeah, definitely. Um, I was gonna say Sadie, but yeah, that is yeah. that your favorite too? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Also, I told mom that I picked the setup of the question. I said pick two people that are gonna fight at camp. You gotta do it. Two people who would um who would win in a fight and you gotta choose the people. And I'm gonna say Grimshaw and Dutch. <laughs> okay, who do you think would win in a fight? Grimshaw well, Grimshaw or Dutch? badass, so I think she her. is. In yeah. a fist fight, not with a gun. Oh yeah, right. Definitely. Yeah. Okay. She's Let us pretty know. tough. She is tough. Um Yeah, because I can't see Dutch hitting a woman well, he killed a woman actually yeah. in Blackwater. So True. maybe he would. Who you you go for? God, that's such a hard question. Um, yeah. I feel like Dutch would probably beat her up. Because if cause he's so? kind of crazy as fuck right now. Who would you like to see fight? It, who would I like to see fight? I would like to see um, John and Javier. And of course you're pulling for John. Of course I'm pulling for John. All right, mm -hmm. good. Who would you pull for? John, for sure. Okay. So that's the question. If Grimshaw and Dutch were in a fight, who would win? And then John and Javier. And this is a fist fights only. So. Yes. Um, alrighty. Well, thank you guys for watching. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. I don't want to grow up. I'm a Toys R Us kid. Look at all the silly, stupid things I just did. There's balls and bats and little rats. You're singing our version of that. Is that really not the real song? No, it's not. What is it? It's not that. What else would it be? There's balls and bats and something. I don't know what else. Not little rats. Mm, that's <laughs> I just made that up. Oh, that's funny. I totally thought that was the real song. I guess it makes sense that Toys R Us wouldn't be promoting kids playing with rats. Little rats. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just made funny. that up when you were little. That's funny. I didn't know you thought it was real. Yeah. <laughs>